What's going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new Minecraft video. I hope everyone's having a really good day so far uh, because today guys, we are back with part two of the Headless Steve incident. If you guys are unaware as to what happened last week on the channel, we found a new lore because you guys have been requesting it. I went out, created a brand new Minecraft world and we were on the search for a Headless Steve. It's pretty simple. It's just a regular default Steve skin just minus the head at first i didn't think it was actually gonna work but little do we know headless steve is actually real and could be lurking in your minecraft world too i saw all the support you guys showed on the first headless steve video and i just want to say real quick thank you guys all so much for all the support and the the concerns and the the tips as to what i should do everything just genuinely thank you all so much today we are back with part two and i have full intentions on fighting and hopefully being able to take out this headless steve so the first episode of the headless steve stuff that's been going on i mentioned that i was going to do a little bit of work off camera here because i wanted to not only number one i wanted to set up a base that i could hide at would which would be hopefully suitable enough for the situation which i did i also went out and farmed a little bit and i got a book and started documenting everything that happened this is what i have in the book so far day one i found headless steve first sighting was near a village seems to be aggressive i wanted to note this stuff down it's good to have i mean if something happens then this is noted down so people will know i went ahead and started preparing to fight headless steve only needs some more iron to complete the set which i still stick to i only have six pieces of iron um <laughs> yeah i had eight but i wanted a sword you know I also have my bed, but one other cool thing I did set up here was this door, which we can now leave and re-enter our base. I mean, look at this. Does this not look cool? Before, it was wide open, and Headless Steve actually scared me inside of here, so now it's completely blocked off, so we should be all right. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go any further in today's video, I want to give you guys your shout-outs, and then we are going up against Headless Steve, hopefully once and for all. If you guys aren't on the channel, as always guys, make sure you guys subscribe and leave a like on today's video. You see the shark emoji right here? This shark emoji is gonna be hiding at a random timestamp throughout today's video. Could be five minutes in, 10 minutes, or even 15 minutes in. I don't even know. <laughs> all you guys are gonna do is watch the entire video. When you see the shark emoji, drop a comment down below in the comment section of the timestamp it's at. One of you guys will be chosen in tomorrow's video to receive a shout out. But I'm thinking this is a special occasion. I know a lot of you guys have been asking shout outs. Let's do three of them this time, shall we? Bam, bam. Bam! Congratulations to all you guys for your shoutouts there. I know I said we could do six because there's six of them, but three I think is pretty fair. But now, one of you guys are going to be getting a shout out in the next video. All right, guys. So one of the main things I wanted to do here is obviously I did not actually have enough iron uh, to complete a set. I'm going to go ahead and smelt the remaining little bits and pieces of iron we have. And I wanted to make my way back to the village. The reason I want to head back to the village is I know there's a chest in there which could contain some more iron, which then I can use to complete the set. And if we complete the set, obviously, we're just going to be more and more strong and have a better advantage against Headless Steve. So we'll just take a moment, smelt this, and head on over. I'll bring a pickaxe with me, too. And also, I'll bring my book so I can document anything that goes down. Oh, boy. It seems like it's already nighttime out there. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm thinking we could do... What should we do? Uh, we could do leggings, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no. We, we are one iron off from doing pants. You know what? I'm going to save the iron because I have a funny feeling that there's going to be some iron at the village. We have everything we need, though, nonetheless, guys. Everything is locked up. The base is locked up. You know, I'm not going to make the same mistake and not bring a torch with me this time. So now we have some. <laughs> I'm going to put some torches down by the Headless Steve signs just so we can see them. Yeah, as you guys can see, nothing has changed since episode one. I mean, for all I know, the Headless Steve himself could have despawned. Other than the little bit of off-camera work I did, I haven't been on here. So, I, for all I know, it could have despawned. Wait, wait, what is going on? Okay, something really bad is happening at the village right now. Uh, I, think there's, I think there's a fire. Wait, wait, oh my gosh. Wait, no, there he is. The, the Headless Steve's real. Okay, oh my gosh. I just saw the Headless Steve. This definitely has to do with the Headless Steve. Oh my gosh, dude. The second I thought everything was going to be okay. The village is burning. Wait, I need to get to that chest. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, oh my gosh. Guys, you can see all the villagers. All the poor villagers are struggling here. Their entire village is burning down. This definitely has something to do with the Headless Steve. He's the only one that could be able to do this. Wait, there he is, there he is, there he is, there he is, there he is. Hey, hey, what's up? What's up? Come here. Okay, is the chest still there? Please, 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 please. Yes, let's go. I called it. Okay, we got iron goodies for days. Let's go. Oh my gosh, no. No way. Wait, guys, I hit him. 
The headless Steve. He was holding a shovel. Was that a shovel in his hand? I am more than certain that that was a shovel. Okay. Uh. Guys, he's using potions. The headless Steve is using potions. He's heal instant health potions. You're telling me that one hit I got on him actually dealt damage? Wait, can I just... Oh, wait, no way. He's actually retaliating. He's fighting me. Wait, come here. Come here. Oh, my gosh. He's gone. He's just... Oh, oh wait, no, it's behind me. Wait, he can teleport like that? Oh, my gosh, dude. Wait, who is this guy? Oh, my gosh. I'm just going to close that up real quick. Yeah, I can still... Yeah, well, guess what? Boom! Yeah, you didn't see that coming, did you? You didn't see that coming. What about this? Did you... Oh, wait. No, I can't reach him. Ow. Come here. Wait. Oh, my gosh, dude. This guy... He's... Why is he fighting me with a shovel in the first place? That's the one thing I don't get. I'm actually dealing damage to him. Oh, my gosh. He just keeps disappearing. I have a funny feeling the reason it's disappearing is because I'm dealing a lot of damage to him. And he's following. He's following. I need to get back to the base right now. I should be able to make a chest play with all the iron we have. Oh, no. The Headless Steve is following me. If I set up the base correctly, the Headless Steve might not be able to get in. Oh, my gosh. Wait. Never mind. If they can teleport, then they can probably definitely get inside. Okay. Okay. There we go. There we go. Come on. Come on. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Now, now, now. Go. Oh. Please tell me you didn't see the button. Please, please tell me you didn't see the button. I'm going to go ahead and hold shift. Um, and I'm also going to place cobblestone. You guys saw that, right? You guys literally just saw that, right? The headless Steve's shovel that he was attacking me with was just sticking through the wall. Okay. Oh, uh, he just picked up the block. There it is. He's right there. He is right there. You can literally see him. There's his arm. I'm going to go ahead and place some cobblestone there. In hopes that he'll leave. I'm also holding shift too. Uh, I can't see up there. Oh yeah, no, he's still there. I know he's still there. Even if he opens the door, he still won't be able to get in because this block is blocking it. Unless he breaks the block, he won't be able to get in. Oh no, don't mess with the trap door. Okay, we'll do that for now. It's completely enclosed. We're okay. Okay, so we have in total nine pieces of iron. Which means I can now make a chest plate, which is perfect. I am decked out in armor right now, guys. The reason I wanted to wait to get full armor, I mean, I could have gotten diamond armor. I realistically probably could have cheated for diamond armor too, but I wanted to do this legit. I can only imagine the amount of people that are watching this video that go ahead and try it after. I wanted to try and do this legit the entire time because I know it does take a while to get this. I know it can take long. I know a lot of the times they won't appear. I figured doing this in survival was probably the best plan of action. I need to double check in. Is he still there? Okay. I don't think he's there anymore. If I'm correct, the Headless Steve is no longer outside of the house. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open the door. All right. Headless Steve, if you are out there, I am ready and I'm not afraid. Three, two, one. Uh oh, what the? Wait. What in the world? Okay. Okay. Everything's okay. I'm gonna... Are those cats? I'm gonna note down... Wait, yeah, those are cats! Wait, there are flying cats? What? Wait, it's coming from right there. Um, okay. Let me break this sign real quick. There he is. I can see him right that way. What was he throwing? What is that? Oh my gosh, no. Come on, come on. I can't even tell. Is it a mob that's just like aggroed on me? Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. This headless Steve guy is really, really getting on my nerves. I, he's just targeting me. Oh, wait, guys. I think the sun's coming up right now. We might have a better chance of surviving this if it is during daytime. Oh, my gosh. She's right there. All right, fine. You know what? I've got armor now. You still don't have anything on. If I had Notch Apples, this would be so much better. But I am totally got this fight on the upper hand. Especially with me doing crit attacks. Yep, this is critical damage. And I know it hurts too. I know this hurts. The only problem is I don't know how much health this guy's got. Oh, okay. But the second he starts backing up is when he's getting low. Oh, yeah. Really? You're going to vanish away again? All right, let's go. Oh, really? A cobblestone's going to stop me? Really? 
these critical attacks. I know he's about to die. Oh my gosh. So you're telling me the Headless Steve attacks players with a shovel? I mean, you can use anything else, but you decided to use a shovel? Oh my gosh, these punches are actually hurting too. What? He's just gone again. Oh my God, he's back, he's back. What, how is this? He just vanishes, heals up and then comes back. Oh, yep, how's that feel? Yep, I can, I can continuously do these crit attacks on you. Just like this, every time. Come here, boom, boom, boom. He's walking like an AI too. See, he's spinning around and everything. Oh my gosh, guys, this thing, this thing. What is this? This is the weirdest boss I've ever fought. I'm, and he, he vanished. Guys, I still don't understand why this Steve is fighting with a shovel. Oh my gosh, wait. If you're gonna try and scare me like that and jump scare me, try and kill me at the least, because if anything, you're going down. Oh my gosh, dude. Look at how many hearts this guy is getting dealt. Yep, ow, 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 ow. Yep, run away, run away, keep running. Yep, yep. Ooh, I might have actually almost killed him. He just keeps spawning and then falls. Oh, he's low, he must be low. Yeah, he's... Huh? What? I just killed the Headless Steve. And this is what he dropped? I have an entire inventory full of wooden shovels. And you're telling me this is all I got? I went out and I fought this monster. And I got... Wooden shovels? Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me right now. No way. Look at this. I'm still just pressing Q on all these. It's still dropping and I'm picking them up. Maybe if you guys know more about the Headless Steve than I do. I know a lot of you guys seem to know quite a bit about this situation, actually. More than I originally thought. If any of you guys have fought the Headless Steve in the past, I want you guys to let me know in the comments. Did he drop shovels when you killed them? I am very, very curious. But in fact, I'm going to go ahead and actually break the summon signs for now. In hopes that this Steve will not be returning for a little bit. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get back in the base here and lock up. Okay, yeah, this is just I don't get this at all. I'm putting all my stuff in here and I'm gonna leave my inventory full of the wooden shovels. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. We fought and we beat the headless Steve. Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys enjoyed today's video and you guys want to see maybe a part three, maybe if something else comes up that I find out about the Headless Steve, we could do another video on. But ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for me today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, uh, I would really appreciate it if you guys could just drop a like on today's video and uh, subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. But ladies and gents, that's going to be it for me today. Have a safe and fantastic rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow in a brand new video. Take care. Hey, did you guys enjoy today's video? If you guys did, there's a playlist of video right over there. All you guys got to do is click that or tap on your screen and you'll automatically be sent to my next video where a brand new adventure starts. So until then, I'll see you there.